Oh my god, you guys. Hi. Oh, you hit me. <laughs> If you've been here before, thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. Um, you're a blessing to me. You're a blessing to me. <clears throat> I know y'all probably be thinking, like, what the hell is wrong with her? God, come on. <laughs> Alright, so listen. I'm going to do this video in my real accent. Um, and I'm going to try not to convert back to my voice that I fakely used, um, to get the job done, you know, you know, when I be at work and stuff like that. So, okay, so basically this video would be get to know me video and... I want you guys to get to know me, like, really, really actually get to know me, um, okay, so, okay, so, oh, gracious, y'all, where can I start at, okay, so, ugh. okay, hold on, I quit, I know how to get this started, I know how to get it started, I will be temporarily smoking cigarettes <laughs> in this video. Just got my teeth white in this morning. Oh my gosh, she looks good, don't she? You know. <laughs> okay, so let's start with my resume. A lot of people think that my resume is fake. It is not. Um. <laughs> okay, hold on. When I talk about my resume, people think my resume is fake. My resume is not fake. Everything I've done on my resume is accurate. It is real. Um, I'm also finna I've already got um I've already got um Tax prepare on there, but I'm not fully tax prepared certified yet. But it is on there. I'm gonna have to put med tech on there, which I'm not fully certified yet in med tech. So those are will be those will be the only two things on there that aren't like fully really like in spaghetti, you know. Okay, so as I'm going through my resume, I'm gonna just tell y'all about me. Um, and just other random stuff in between then and things like it. Okay. Um, <laughs> um, um, okay, so. Cleaning PCA HHA. I am a professional cleaner. As of 2021, and I've been a PCA since 2021, HHA 2021. Um, I love being a caretaker. I love being a professional cleaner. I love being a professional cleaner more. Um, I just love to clean. Like I just, I enjoy it so much. I love it so freaking much i just i just love to clean um my car is a little bit messy right now because i just put groceries in here um and i've been on the road a lot doing work since my surgery after maybe like five days after my surgery i start back working again it was light work, but I started back working again. I, got, I still got to pay bills, regardless. Um, okay. <clears throat> um, 
I really started out doing caretaker. It was for my mom. And then my mom put me on to her friend girl, which her mom needed to take care of. And it just went from there. Um, Creative Mind Company. Sorry, y'all. Hold on. Creative Mind Company. CSW CMCAS. That is my name initial CSW. CMC means Creative Mind Company. AS means Papa Specialist. Papa Specialist is cut between Creative Mind Company and Papa Specialist. Um, mostly, let me say it this way. I want y'all to like know. Okay. Okay. I'm going into the bowels, into the bowels, going into the bowels, <laughs> going into the creme de la creme. Yeah, my eczema has spread to my big toe, and I just tear my, but it itches, and I'm going to try my hardest not to scratch on line, but it's very itchy. It's very hitchy. Okay. All right. So basically, Creative Mind Company is crafting. It is. The Diva Express, it is my boutique. Hava Specialist is more on the PCA side, the professional clinic side. And the reason why I split them up like that is because it just let, lets people know what I'm talking about. Like, for an example, if I put Creative Mind Company, you will know what I'm talking about. If you know if I put Hava Specialist, you know what I'm talking about cleaning and um p state h h a um my boutique i've had my boutique since twenty thirteen and i started creating um in two thousand and five in two thousand and five is really heavy when I started working for other people and working for myself doing hair um there's everything you can think of in my boutique um My work alarm's telling me almost time to go. Um, I don't have to work until Monday, Tuesday. So this video should be posted up before then. Today is August the 31st. So this is the last day of August. So happy September, period. September is coming in, fall is coming in. I'm so excited. I love the fall. My skin is already ready for the fall. <laughs> she's already she already has a golden glow, <laughs> darling. Um see, I told y'all I was gonna convert back to my regular voice. I just realized it. Okay, so I, I really want to give Southern, but I really do. Like, so let's let me just keep it at this. Because like now I've gotten comfortable with talking in my regular not my normal voice in my professional voice um so we'll just keep it like that um it's gonna pop out though <laughs> i ain't gonna say it ain't, i ain't gonna say the subs one ain't gonna pop out but um yeah you guys so but excuse me i've done i just got to eat i've done so much with creative my company i actually talked about that today on my TikTok, um, 
I literally used to make my tote bags out of ribbon, duct tape, fabric, and staples. Not kidding at all. And I told my mom, like, mom, you want me to sell this, but really, if you were to put everything that you have in your pocketbook in this purse, it's not going to last. I would not want my customers to be like, oh, my bag then ripped already. It's only been one month. Because what if you have a baby? You might be carrying their bottle, a couple of pampers, their toys, and your stuff in there too. And you might have a little block full back in there. You know what I'm saying? That's already heavy anyway. So it's just not, it's just not going to fit. <clears throat> and like, I know how heavy, oh, you know, that is. So, and you know, to put it, to put a, in with your other stuff plus maybe another person's stuff it's just it's not gonna work so um upgraded years later to i said i want to sew i i already know how to sew i already know how to draw i already know how to make things like but this will be new for me like making bags and purses and stuff like that and i said but i if Mommy want me to sell these, but I want this to be right though. My mom helped me start my boutique. She was like the she was like the the she was the the muscle behind Creative Mind Company. Um the ideas, the the push me person. And she invested into it in the beginning. And I just kept it going and just kept thinking of more things to add on to it. I've always been into jewelry, but I got more into jewelry um, because I, I just, I, I love wearing jewelry. So I'm just like, you know what? I see girls with very, very beautiful jewelry pieces on. And they're so unique and so beautiful. And I'm that type of girl. Like back in the day, I used to order my jewelry from eBay. It'd be like 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, even 100 bucks. Um, and those pieces were so unique and I never seen other people with them on and I was like you know what that's what I want that's what I want to do I want to make very unique pieces that will people will be like this is one of a kind nobody else will have that um and then I had a friend of mine tell me she was like you know what babe I think you should make at least duplicates of mm -hmm. that's, <clears throat> that's if whatever I buy have two or more of those same pieces. To hunt for that is like, ugh. But, um, I said, okay, that'll be the next step. I'll give it a try, you know? Um, I've done warehouse work. Um, I've worked in facilities where I've had to take care of 10, 10 plus people every single day. Um, I've worked in hotel. I've worked in, uh, doing like showcase designer and like, um, head cashier. I've been an office assistant. Um, of course, professional cleaning. Um, I've worked in a hair salon, being a shampoo girl, um, brand ambassador, I've been a model, um, I, my schooling, I did not finish high school, um, I ain't, like, oh my god, like, I'm a deadbeat, I don't have, no, I don't feel like that about myself at all, um, because eventually I am going to go back. Just so many things happened. My mom was sick. And then 
I just stopped everything to completely take care of her. And then my sister got sick. Well, my sister had a baby. Then my sister got sick. Um, so I pushed it back some more. Well, I was going to school and then I let it go. And um and I just put it on the back burner. And then my dad passed. I pushed it back some more. Then my sister passed away. And I was just like, this is like I just don't want to deal with nothing. Like, um, but I still kept going and got things up underneath my belt just so that way I could get further and make more money. So, um, I went, let me start at the bottom. Um, but when I was in high school, I was in ROTC. Um, I was in honor civics. Um, I went to school for interior design. I went to school for makeup. I went to school for PCA, and then I went to school for skin and wound care, which is related to PCA, HHA, um, and then I'm currently in tech school right now, and I also went to school and finished for um, security and privacy for big data. Like, like breaching and big data security and privacy. You may wonder, why did you go to school for that? I just like computers. <laughs> <laughs> the classes didn't take a long time to do, and I just, I just love computers. And so they have good conversation started drawing, you know, a little something, something. <laughs> um, let's see what else. I I'm little. I am little. Like I'm not little. Like, I'm not skinny, but I'm like I'm short. I'm I've always been a petite, fitted body frame female. But I love to eat. You will see me probably eat three times in this video. I'm not kidding. I'm very serious. I'm very, very serious. Um, my favorite restaurant, shout out to Mickey's. <laughs> um, McDonald's, which I call Mickey's. Um, Zaxby's. Subway, Chick Fil A. Um, I like Lone Star. I like um, Ruby Tuesday. Um, I love Hams. I love Hams. Like I love, 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 love Hams. The W, Natty Green. Um. The Hibachi. The Hibachi place. <laughs> um, let's see. Taco Bello. I'm not gonna say what I don't like. So many people sliding on me, so I don't want to add more to it. Um let's see. Although Walmart is not a restaurant. Walmart was good. 
I love Wally Wally. Love Wally. Love Wally. Uh. Period. Duh. <laughs> um. Okay, but I'm you know. There's a couple of other places that I've been. I don't remember the name of it. Let's see. What else? Um, you didn't mention I went to makeup school, right? I love makeup, but I don't wear anymore, much anymore. Um, same with lashes. I just took my nails off this morning. We we'll only had like four of them left, honey. Okay. But I just did a whole set of press ons for myself. Because my nails was tan, dark tan, and gold cheetah print. So the tan, my like literally, my tan has ran out. So one side will be tan, one side will be turquoise. And I was like, so when those, the tan ones start to break it or fall off or not lose them, cleaning up or working or whatever, I just start painting the other set turquoise until that whole hand is turquoise. Use what left out the bottom, babe. Um, let's see. Sometimes I do talk with my mouth full. I've been out of work for a month because I had atopic pregnancy. I have endometriosis. And I'm not saying that to, oh my God, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Or for people that feel bad for me or nothing like that. I want you to support me. I want you to support other people that has dealt with that is dealing with endometriosis. That's why I say it. Between anxiety and working, that's why this has been my second atopic pregnancy. People really be thinking, like, when they see me, like, oh, she don't work, she don't do nothing. Yes, I do. I'm doing it now. With a food break. That was my third Rice Krispie, y'all. I shouldn't have got that box. I really shouldn't have. And I just whitened my teeth this morning. And who won't?
honey, I don't care about nothing. And I'm finna rinse it out right here. I'm gonna put it right back in my pocketbook. I misplaced my top. I always lose them. Them little tops is just so little. That's why I like getting Aquafina. Because those little tops, you can see them. Them little other tops is clear. They blend in. No, with one sitting on top of the other one. No, good off with her. No. If they ain't completely dry, I try for them not to double on top of each other. Oh my God, you guys. Okay, so something else too. I started something called In and In, and it means nails and novelty. I'm mixing nails in with readings. Hey, copyright. <laughs> so, um, and I'm really excited for it. I really am. Um, uh, I've been doing nails for a very long time, and despite the fact it, I hate doing acrylic in jail. Um, I do put a very light layer of acrylic on them so that way your nail will not bend. <laughs> Did you hear what I said? <laughs> bend where? Nowhere. That's why. <laughs> um, I can't shake myself up too much. My belly button been hurting this morning. Well, this afternoon because it's seven o'clock right now. Um, yeah. I'm very, very excited about it. Um, I have not sold a set yet, but it's only been two months. Um, and I'm kind of moving a little slow with it because it came out in July. I got sick in August. So besides my bills, everything else is just pushed back a month back. That's very far. Like I have not touched any of my stuff since like August the 7th. Like no, like probably like in between the 5th and the 7th. I have not touched none of my business stuff. I've literally been sick since August the 8th. Well, re really since August. That's why I said the 6th. Like, since August the 6th, 7th, I've been sick. But my first hospital visit was on the 8th. My second hospital visit was on the 14th. And then I had to have immediate surgery that day. It was in the hospital for three days. I ain't seen that, honey. Um, but I'm very excited about this nail thing. I really am. Um, I go back to the doctor on September the 3rd. I forgot that. The 1st is a Sunday. Monday is Labor Day. Yeah. And then on Tuesday, so Monday and Tuesday, I have to work Labor Day and the next day after. So I was like, well, I'll just go to my appointment afterwards after working and you know labor day stuff open back up and da 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 da, da and you know because once i travel someplace i get multiple things done in that city before i leave it if i'm new to it of course i i'm just up there for a customer and then i go um i might stay around just to look around and see what they have and stuff like that because I'm still trying to pick a place for my land. Um, gonna tell you guys about the land as well, but yeah, um, in and in, I'm very, very excited for it. I, I really, really am. 
I finally got in um, to figure out how those little nail sticks work. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Um, what I mean by nail sticks is like this thing that you sit your nail on top of. I don't have it with me. Um, um, you sit your nail on so that way you can polish. And I finally found out how I finally figured out how to use it. <laughs> So yeah, um, the in the end land. I I have so many ideas for my land. Um, what I want to do is have it for people that is going through like homelessness going through they don't have any parents they don't have any family they can't get resources they have a job and they still can't get by da, 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 da. so there's gonna be the land and there's gonna be <clears throat> the back or the back either left or right it doesn't matter depending on the sides, I'm going to have my container house. Um, then in the front, well, this is how it's going to start in the beginning. Because cause it's going to be small. And then as the time go on, it's going to grow. And then I'm just going to eventually sell that little plot of land. Um, but let's just jump to the how it would look if it was a large size. Um, no, no, let's start from the the, the creme de la creme. Um, in the beginning, container house in the back, Christmas tree shop, and veggie farm. And I'm going to start off with just chickens. Then, when it's the big land, um, a large amount of land, or whatever we want to call it, um, container house, um, Two chickens, two cows, a goat. I want a sheep just because. And I want a llama just because. <laughs> I'm getting a llama. Llama, a llama is happening in my life. You hear what I said, what I said, what I said it. Okay. <laughs> and, um... Christmas tree shop and veggie farm. And I want to have at least five to ten areas. I really want it to be up to like 25 or 30. But like it just got to just, I don't know. I'm just going to figure it out. But um, let's just say hypothetically like 10 or 12. Um, And I know how to make that work. Um, it won't be one each, or it would be, I don't know. Anyway, moving on. Um, people can come there, and I can help them with resources. If you live in your car, if you live in your truck, if you live in your van, um, I don't care. As long as you, if you don't have a job, that's fine. I can help you find that. But, like, having a job, finding the right resources, um, for your situation, um, having jobs already ready for people to come in and start working and not just temp, like real actual permanent work, um, get you certified in some things that you like, I know who to deal with, to, you know, for, for that, um, if you want to start a company, I know how to get, um, merchandise that got people's. Um, if you want to do promo, I got peoples. Um, just that, like you know, um, if you need to, f well, that hell, I'm having an issue with that. Um, finding a good mechanic. Well, by that time, I'll be, you know, what I'm saying, which I do know one good mechanic. 
Um, but <clears throat> um, I did have two, but one has retired now. Um, but yeah, you know, just like helping people that's going through a hard time. And I know my glasses look crazy, but it's been hurting my ear. I need to go inside a wall and have them straighten it because I don't feel like driving all the way to my doctor's office because it's like it's really hurting my ear. I, don't, I hope it's not making it wrong because ain't nobody got time for that. But it is, it has been hurting me. And then my hair being curly is a lot going on. But anyway, um, all behind my ear and all that and blah, 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 blah. Um, what else? Let's see. Um, eventually I am going to quit smoking cigarettes. I'm out right now, so no, I'm not. <laughs> Um, I do pay so much more cheaper for my cigarettes, and other people do as well. If you already, if you know, you know. Um, tobacco is not chewing tobacco. That is actual cigarette packing tobacco. Um, the bag is in between nine, well, eight to about. 17 to 19 bucks. The rollies are about two to three bucks. And it will last you, depending on how much you smoke, it'll last you two weeks to a month. Oh, mine lasts me two and a half weeks. <clears throat> Fantastic. I love it. I really do. And I carry my stuff around in a little bucket. A bin, I bought like ten of these bins from Wally from Walmart, and I use one of them for me to house my tobacco, my rollies, and my rolling machine. Um, sooner or later, I want to put like locks, like I want to drill holes through this and put locks around it. Be careful when you roll tobacco because. You're asking somebody to poison you. Since I'm like my eyes is always on mine and I learned my lesson. Um ain't nobody got, they can't. But anyway, um I'm a PCA. I love love. It's always safety first. Like I ain't gonna say what I wanna say. Anyway. Um, it's always safety first, it's always God bless, it's always love until you show me differently. That's when I'm gonna get ugly on you. But um anyway, I'm a very sweet person. I love love. Like I don't disrespect anybody. I don't then would really be no reason for anybody to disrespect me unless they are and I know I've had people tell me like, Oh, what are they jealous of? You don't know me either. So Excuse me. Um, but anyway, um, if you a hard worker, if you take care of yourself, if you keep yourself up, if you, even if you in a boardroom or a hotel, like it don't even matter. Like people that 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 it ain't even about material. It's really what's in you. When people dislike you over just you being you, you are not the problem. You need to understand that. You're not the issue, darling. It like it's black stuff right here, but it's not. I got a gap right there. That's a lot of... Um, it's not you, love. It's not. It's them. They're the problem. Um, what is making this not new? Right. Hey, y'all. <laughs> um, but yeah, they just they dislike your aura. This they dislike your energy. Again, they are the problem, not you. You don't done nothing. 
They're going to make up lies about you. They're going to make up rumors about you. They're going to spread things about you that's not true. You're just going to have to eat that and keep going. Eat through it and just keep going. Because that's what going up the ladder is going to give you. There are going to be people that don't like you. Let's move on. So that's going to make me... It's going to fuss on my spirit. Um... Oh, yeah. Um, I'm a very clean person. That's why I went into... Excuse me, God, my allergy is so bad. That's why I went into... They just flared any time. That's why I went into professional cleaning because that's like up my alley. Like I love cleanliness. Like I love it. Yesterday, I cleaned my wheel off really good. The door, where most touch areas, I cleaned them the most. I swept the floor. I organized my food. You know that I'm a travel PCA. Travel. Everything I do is travel outside of my boutique. I travel doing everything. You make an order for nails, you make an order for my boutique, you make an order for jewelry, whatever. I'm going to still have to take it to the post office. Or if you're local, like, I can take it to you. Um, I'm going to try to get it to a point where you can order it and it still doesn't have to come through another source, which I love my source. I've been with my source for so long. Um, Poshmark, by the way. Um, I started with Etsy, but when they became more of like, like, handmade only stuff, I kind of like backed away a little bit from it because, well, I backed all the way from it. No disrespect to Etsy. I love Etsy still. I still order from Etsy. Um, I wanted to get into wholesale. So that was like, okay, I'm just going to back away a little bit because I want to be in wholesale. Um, Now that I'm back making things, I just haven't jumped back on the bandwagon because I just been so focused on wholesale. I've been going to school for different things and, you know, um, I'm going to be going to school for med tech, um, giving medication and things like that or whatever. I'm very excited about that. Um, it's 65 to 85 bucks, depending on what school you go to. One would say, will you not choose the cheaper one? Because that school may give you more knowledge. The $85 one may give you more, you know, or the $70 one, the $75 one, whatever. Because I think it's $65, $75, $85. $75. If I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong. It could be $65, $72, $85. I could be wrong. But anyway, um, I want the best. Not because the price is higher, it's the best. I don't like that either. Like, people love taking pictures of me. Please don't do that. Because I'm getting to a point where I'll get your tag and I'm going to tell the police that you are invading my privacy. You did not ask for a picture of me. Yeah. I'm not kidding. Um, some people think that I'm hateful because I be very strict about certain things. I don't care. I really don't. Um, that's my privacy. This is my life. You're not going to destroy my life. You're not, I'm sorry, not going to try to destroy my life. You're not going to make up things about me. You're not going to disrespect me in the public. You're not going to take pictures of me without my consent. You're not going to touch my property without my consent. You're not going to break my property. You're not going to tamper with my things. Like, no, you're just not. Because I know that I'm a sweet person. I don't bother nobody. All I do is work and eat and sleep. 
literally i work eat sleep this is genuine you're genuinely getting me in this video i work eat and sleep that's all i do so nobody should be bothering me nobody should be making up nothing about me nobody should be doing nothing none of that nothing to me so i'm just gonna pop you into the fuzz like i'm not no snitch but when you are invading my privacy when you are when you are tampering with my things when you are breaking my things when you are doing things like that I just, I don't have a tolerance level for it anymore. I have so many things that I have to do and not just for myself, but for other people. So you're not gonna, you're not gonna put me in harm's way knowing that I have people to take care of and I, well, I have patients to take care of because my sister is no longer here. Um, my brother, he's doing well. My older brother, he not around, you know, he, so it, no. I have patients to take care of. I have people that depend on me to clean for them, to, and then going into medicine to give them their medicine. Like, oh, Chanel can't come in today. Like, I, I have people that ask for me. No. I'm almost 40 years old. I don't have this night. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. I act my age. And if you can't act yours, I'm going to give you a reason to start. And I walk around talking about people, disrespecting people, making up about people, doing all. I don't, I don't care about. I'm worried about like growing my company so I can help other people. I'm not. I don't know. You in my way, and I'm gonna just go ahead on and let them let the, that twelve handle it. So, cause you in my way, I ain't got time for it. Hey, look, they did it. All right, bye. Like, my new model is, I got people to take care of, and I have land to buy. What's up? Like, what do you do? I don't got time. Mm -mm. People call me, oh, I seen your car, or I been looking for you, or I, I got a new phone number, I lost Chanel, but people looking for me, honey. People want Chanel. <laughs> I'm just thinking now, y'all. But I'm just, I mean, they do. But I'm just saying, it's just like, no. Like, I don't have time for all that. That's not, that's, mm -mm. no. And that ain't nothing but the devil anyway. So, I don't play with that. I'm a high Christian. I had one lady ask me, what is a high Christian? Chill with me for a month. I show you what it is. God will show you what it is through me. And uh, I can definitely help you get a very clear understanding. I'm not going to say what it is in this video. <sighs> Let's see what else. My favorite hairstyles. I'm just thinking of anything at this point. Because uh, I've been going for an hour. Um... Favorite hairstyle is the little, they not call, they not Havana Swiss.
<laughs> yeah, I don't know what it's called. But like they just it's like I I hear it's single, single like that. Like that. And it's like you twisted the hair around it, the Marley hair around it. Oh, love it. And I do mine a different way. I put little knots in it. Like I'll literally tie it and pull it and it'll be like little knots through it. I've hit my hair like that three times. <laughs> they look like dreads, but they not. Um, that's why I had my little five back here. That was only four because one of my patients pulled it out from my scalp. But she's still here. Um, I love it. It's so beautiful. Um, right now I have in poetic justice braids. I've had them in now for about a month in. Like a month and fifteen days. Um, I really want to get these out so bad, but I just been so busy and then swoop turn right around. I'm not gonna have a labor day, so I'm not gonna go to the beach. Um, I was picking with a friend earlier, saying like I feel like the beach just it's just my stomach hurt. I'm going to the beach. <laughs> I just had surgery. I'm going to the beach. <laughs> uh. I'm saying I'm something. I'm going to the beach. <laughs> like, for real. Like, I'm here for the beach. I live for the beach in the water, honey. You hear me? It's, just, it's the same for me. It's the same between my toes. I'm there with you. <laughs> and just to look very far out and be like, just the water just go and go and go and go like that. Like, look at that. Do you see? Like, I be wanting to, like, just look back. Because, like, I usually be, like, by myself or whatever or on the phone with my bestie. And I tell her, like, but you just look at this. I just be wanting to turn around and just ask anybody, do you see this? It just go and go. That is so, oh, my gracious. Like, where to end it? And if I got pictures or something, <laughs> like, I want to see. Like, the rainbow. Like, where is, like, where the end and beginning like where exactly like if anybody just like walk can you walk through it like have you walked through it anybody walk through it anybody just did their hand like that i just want to know you know it just it just it just puzzles me um so i'm gonna be sorry y'all that was in the shot um so i'm gonna be um, working on Labor Day, so I'm not gonna go to the beach. I may go afterwards just to treat myself because literally after my surgery, I started working five days later. It's giving balls. Seriously. Anybody that has to work five days or less after having surgery and being under anesthesia to where you could not open your eyes until like maybe like almost going into like the second day, the afternoon of. Like I'm like, yeah, I guess so. What happened? Oh, all right. What'd you say? Okay, what did you say? <laughs> like, like, I'm going back to probably about like 35 minutes ago, 40 minutes ago. Chill. They didn't probably ate and everything. But, um, ate, went, used the bathroom and all. <clears throat> but, yeah, like, I, I just, I need to treat myself. I really do. Cause I've been doing nothing but just cleaning, 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 cleaning. Cause my my first job, I will have to lift up elderly people, and I can't lift over anything of jug of a jug of milk. Now I'm at a point where I can lift a half a case of water. A whole case of water still hurt me. I can feel my belly button pulling. Um, my second job, which is I'm a fill-in, the first job is part-time, the second job I'm just a fill-in, but it's just cleaning, and if I'm doing, let's say this is, my hand is my body, if I'm doing a whole bunch of this, having to like get back up and down, then no, like I can't be scrubbing no flow, I can't be 
hand, you know, over the tub or whatever, scrubbing my hand like that, like you doing all that bending over and crunching over like that. Mm -mm, it just got to, and then an uh, old school broom hurts too. You got to have updated bristles. <laughs> like you got to have updated bristles too. Don't even worry about it. I got one in the trunk. I went and buy my own supplies for backup. So the folk be empty. Don't even worry about it. I got you, boo. Um, they ain't got the receipts. Um, but <clears throat> so second job, this is cool. First job. All I have to do is sit and watch this person, but I'm thankful that they found me somebody. Um, and my third job is me. Basically, just and it's a whole bunch of like sitting down because I'm just like I'm sewing, I'm creating. Um, the work tags are still out for sale. Um, I ain't gonna even try to twist my twisting hurts too, like twisting my body around like that. Well, not completely like that. Nobody can do that. <laughs> but like you know, just twisting my body around that hurt. Um. Coming off a curb, I feel better. Sneezing, I feel better. Coughing, that still hurts. Um, sneezing, eh, just a little bit. From like a one to five, five being the worst, I'll give it like a strong two. Um, um, I'm thankful that coming off of a curb doesn't hurt anymore. Like those first like four days was like, bro. And mind you, like I started back working five days after my surgery. Like, good gracious, I did like the, literally the next day I hopped on it, I, I didn't feel the pain, and I was like, oh, let me call some people, um, let's see, let's jump to something else, um, what type of brands do I like, I love Bearberry, Gucci, Louis Vuitton, um, Issa Laurent, Fendi, um, Adidas, Tommy Hilfiger, Nike. I like Jordan clothes. I like Jordan shoes too, but I prefer not to wear Jordan shoes because of how my body is shaped and looking down at my feet. They look like little boats on my feet, but I do like Jordan. I, I do have two pair of Jordans and I, I don't even wear them, but they look good on me though. I don't know like the number of them or nothing like I'm not like a, a, a number person. How people be like, oh, them the Jordans, blue, 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 blue. I don't know. <laughs> I've never known. Um, but they're so cute. And I only really wear them when I want to get like super fly. But um somebody that passed that I love so much but purchased those for me. So I I, I just cherish what well, one of them they purchased, I cherish them. Um, the other one I bought myself. Um, let's see. Um, my clover necklace, and I have clover earrings. I lost one. Thank God that I found it. Um, I bought this off of Amazon. It was a hundred bucks, and. My bracelet is still missing, so I don't know. It probably was stolen. I don't know, but that bracelet not real. So, but anyway, um, uh, but I my jewelry, like Walmart has real jewelry. I get my jewelry from Walmart and. I what it's called. Um, you know, little spice rack too. Hold on, y'all. Montgomery Hub Monogram Montgomery. I be deleting the post or I be deleting the uh, text messages out of my phone when they text me because I don't want to have temptation. I got stuff to do, and I don't want to have temptation. Yeah, Monogram Hub. They got a Labor Day deal right now for 81% off. So, y'all go and check that out. Um, Walmart should have deals on jewelry. 
but I haven't really like been dealing with the jury department right now, just their basic holiday stuff. Um, but go and see if Walmart has deals right now on jewelry. But <clears throat> that's where I get my jewelry from, MoneyGram Hub and Walmart. And again, Walmart does have real jewelry. Um, um, oh yeah, and I don't know it right now, what I'm paying, but there's a shop inside of the Four Seasons Mall in North Carolina. I get my jewelry from them too. I don't know the name of it right now. No, it's not going to be in neither one of these phones. But yeah. Um, what else? What am I infatuated with? Oh my goodness. Uh, I love, like, y'all, this is going to be crazy, okay? I'm just, I'm just saying, you know, at the time, this is going to be a little exact here. I am infatuated with. Paper towels, tissue, baskets, scarves, <laughs> fabric, fingernails. Used to be lashes, but I got my own bitch. <laughs> All right. Um. <laughs> thank you, Lord. Um. What else? Uh, I'm really, these are in stock right now in my boutique. There's no more red, there's no more red and gold ones. Look, these are in my boutique right now of all colors. Crinkle and air for 100 Alex. <laughs> yes, ma'am. And I love doing this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not in that order. It's like, bitch, it's hot. Huh? Oh, okay. What happened? Oh, okay. I thought you said something. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, and I leave it in my car. I love it. Um,. Let's see. I think that's about it. Oh, and this. Look at this. I bought this from Walmart. Do not remember how much it was. But, like, look at this. Like, how sticky key is it? And then, boo yet. Solar panel. <laughs> So cute. I love that little thing so much. Um, let's see what else. And cleanliness. I love getting in my car. I'm going inside a very clean Airbnb. Border room. Hotel. Even someone's house. And it's just so neat. Clean. You will maybe see one or two spots. Or no spots at all. Would just like. <sighs> give me more oxygen. <laughs> I love it so much. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Let's see. I like nature. I love animals. Like... A couple of days ago, I went to, like, this little, like, recreation park or something like that. 
I like where they have like flowers and veggies and you know, like you can sit and chill and da 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 da. It was a very beautiful sunny day. And I was walking out of the bathroom and just butterflies just went flying out the bushes around me. And I kept I was like, oh, oh. And I kept walking and they just, they were following me. And I was like, just pick me up and just take me to the car. You guys, hi, how are you? Good afternoon. You're so beautiful. <laughs> I was so excited. It, it just made everything to me. Um, I, I just love it. I love it so much. I love flower. I love butterfly. I just love it, love it, love it so much. Um, I think that's why I'm kind of turning towards turquoise. Because, like, with the sky being blue, and when you see certain, like, certain things in nature, like, especially if it's, like, like white, or if it has, like, a, a green tone to it, is, is it, like, like, a butterfly? It's, like, as if you can see, like, a, like, a turquoise or, like, a lightish, greenish color or something. Like, I'm like, whoa. Is, was that really actually? I don't, I don't know. It's, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. I really don't know how to explain it. It's just, it's so beautiful. Like, why would you, what the ham sandwich was that? Um, why not? You know, um, I've always loved lime green. I love lime green. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. And also, she is a hearse, darling. Here at the house, sit down, bitch. <laughs> I don't know why I just love being Irish. <laughs> I love the fact that I'm Irish. Um, yeah. Excuse me. Oh, I cannot keep eating these, y'all. Look at this. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, like Shay, put it back. Put that thing right on bed, and I don't want them Pringles. I'm not trying to be funny. I'm gonna eat them, but I I don't really want them. But um, it made me want to do my nails. Talking about takeaways. Um, what else? Um, I am concealed to carry certified. Um, I have been nail. For um, five years, um, let's see, what else? This is my favorite juice i've been drinking this juice for like since like february on it <laughs> this juice is polar blast the hawaiian punch Polar Blast. This juice is so good. Oh my goodness. Polar Blast. Y'all don't buy them up for me. They are so freaking good. Especially with a... Give me extra ice. I'm just kidding. <laughs> and um, this one, all right. But it's like this in the same family. But this one is this fruit fruit punch red. That's what it say. Fruit juicy red. Like this one is straight. But that polar but oh no, listen. I call it the invisible one. Y'all have y'all tasted the invisible one by Hawaiian punch? Like it's like the clear. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. <laughs> 
do not play me, you do not play. I do not play. <laughs> that drink is good. Oh, yes. And this one. Shut the front door up. I'll show you when I'm done packing. Um, packing, I mean, in my, my background. What else? Um, there's another one, too. Um, let's see what else. When this video gets to like 120, I'm cutting it. Um, love y'all. Thanks for watching. Appreciate those who supported me and I'll support you. So, leave your information down below so that way we can get some people not gonna at y'all Um, let's see. Business. No, don't put something up there, Cardi, y'all. Um, let's see what else. I love to laugh. I love to have fun. I love to enjoy. I'm very goofy, very outgoing. Um, I get along with anybody. Um... From adults all the way down to the teens. Like, we can shoot, shoot, shoot. <laughs> we can shoot, you know what I'm mean? saying? We can shoot all of them. Or um, we can kick back and listen to Luther Vandross. I love Luther, though. First of all, um, let's speak of music. Let's speak of music. Um, I just, I get along with any and everybody. I love love. That's just how I've always been that way. Um, let me see if I can find y'all. This is all going on right quick. Ow, ow, ow. Uh, uh, uh. I bought this bag off of Timu. So cute, right? About two of them actually. Okay, so go get the crystal light and raspberry lemonade. Y'all, let me say something. And put two. Do listen, if you use one, it's not gonna taste good. You might like it, but get two. Put two. I ain't gonna be able to fit that back in there. I'm gonna have to wait. So like this. Sit it back on top of the bag so that way I know where I put it. I gotta keep myself organized so that way I'll be able to find myself. I don't understand how my bracelet grew legs and walked away. And I ain't gonna say nobody stole it until I really give my car a thorough deep clean. And which my car has been cleaned, but I'm talking about as in like moving even the heavy luggage in the back because i have a big bag in the back uh in my back seat behind my passenger seat and that bag has clothes in it and so that way i won't have to carry like three four or five bags where it's like this is jeans these are shirts these is towels and washcloths these are dresses and you know, events and, you know, gatherings and greet, meet and greets and get togethers, la 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 la. Um, I could just split everything in half and just put it, something of everything that was in each bag in one bag. Done. <laughs> And then for my jeans, my jeans did stay in the in its original bag that I made specifically for jeans. There's a certain type of fabric that's very thick and very hefty. And very thick and very hefty. And um it's perfect for a lot of comforters or or a lot of jeans so i kept that bag what it was or whatever um which i carry that with me as well um but it really made like a lot of space 
so that way I can pull my driver seat all the way back and lean and then pull the thing and like lean it back like that you know like lean it back like that or whatever and nothing be behind me but like dishes and soda you know like I said I travel doing like everything except for be seat Um, and I just need the leg room. Because my baby is fairly long. And I'm like, why do I feel like cramp like this? That's because all this stuff is in his back seat. Like, but when I, listen, that surgery changed me so much, you guys. I said, I just cannot whoop this stuff in here. Like, Shay, listen, I know that you are, how close upscale, darling? Oh, darling. Hmm. <laughs> but you not need all this stuff separated like this. Like, just... You're going to have to hunt through it. But just take some, take your best out of each bag and just cut the crap. And I did. Like, I just got so irritated. Um, And my irritance level is low with a lot of stuff. Like, a lot of things. Like, people's crap. Um, all of those clothes and things that I had in here, um, and I had, like, way too, did my hair just curl from, okay, all right, here, whatever, bro, um, I was carrying way too many shoes that I did not need. Like, I mean, and it's not that I didn't need them. It was just that, like, it was, like, stuff like, I'm not having many meet and greets. I'm not, I don't really go out anyway. I've always been an inside girl. I've never been an outside girl, but, um... Even just going to, like, get-togethers. Like, I just, I don't even go to get-togethers anymore. Um, but people in dress cute, you know? So, take all of them shoes out, don't need. Um, I had my whole bag of hair. <laughs> Don't do that. Take your bags. Get it out. Um... <clears throat> if you guys work at I want to give you some tips as well if you guys work at home and you want to go outside more just to go outside you know because working at home is the best job in the world hands down nothing else for real for real for real um, oh, that kind of hurt shaking my head like that. How does shaking my head hurt my stomach? Can you calculate it? Can we give it science and mathematics, please? Please. Um, you can purchase little storages to work out of or depending on the uh way that the storage building is set up you can ask the guy or the lady that owns it that owns it not no basic manager or not no not trying to be disrespectful to anybody that's manager if you're a manager high five love you babe um who owns it can you make that into your business storage um and it I love it. It's working out great for me. Like, I love being able to, like, go there and, like, sit and really have peace and create. It, I, I just, I really enjoy it so much. I'm very thankful. I love it so much. Um, the guy that owns it is so nice. He's so respectful. Um, my pen is falling on me. He is zipping. Fan, where you going? Where you going, so Um. 
So yeah, look into that. Um, they should have some that's like seventy dollars and under monthly. Um, cause you don't want nothing that's like a hundred bucks a month. Like this is cutting into your profit money, you know. Um, let's see what else. Oh, you guys, we're on 121. Love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. Let me move these so y'all can see me. I mean, I love you so much. This is so sweet. <laughs> um, I will see you on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for having my back um through the ups and the downs um and i will talk to you on the next one be safe god bless i love you i'm here to support you as well if you have any businesses please link them down below i will definitely reach out to you and let you know when your post will be posted for me to promote you and i will do it for free um just give this video all you have to do is just give this video a thumbs up that's it and watch the whole thing whoopee you better watch the whole thing <laughs> love you guys bye